critical Windows Server Update Service vulnerability is actively being exploited. Find the article and read it for yourself. I will include the link in the description. Now, this only affects Windows Server. So if you have like Windows 11, Windows 10, this doesn't apply to you. It's only for the server class operating system. For those IT personnel who can do this, on Thursday, Microsoft already released a patch for this, so make sure you get it installed. For those who can't do this because they run their servers on a 30-day delay, a little bit further in, it talks about how you could do other things to secure your server from this attack. Now, this is one of the reasons why I really dislike when you know, researchers and so on and so forth publicly make available proof of concept exploit codes because not only are security people watching, but hackers are watching too. And this is a perfect example of proof of concept that was released to the public. So, you know, IT people were aware of it, but now hackers have gotten a hold of it. And from what I'm reading, it looks like this exploit is just now starting to be used by hackers, which looks like on Thursday, a couple of different security companies out there in the world have found about 2,500 instances of it being exploited. I'm sure there is more to come. Now, the quick and dirty way to check for this is to open up PowerShell on your server, run the underlined command. I will put it in the comment section. And if you have any X's in those boxes, then you need to be taking action. If you have no X's in the boxes, it's installed, but it's not actively running. So go definitely protect your client servers or your employer servers.